Hi everybody, it's Nani. How you doing today? I am doing really good. I am back today with a pretty large Dollar Tree haul for you. It's kind of miscellaneous stuff, but some really cool things and a few things I've bought before, but I love it, so I bought them again. So I'm just gonna start like I always do with what I showed in my thumbnail. They're back with the Easter bunnies. I did pick up two. I picked them up last year, and when the family came down for Easter, my Easter bunnies disappeared. So, yep, the ladies took them home. The two older land grand ladies, they took them home. So I picked up two more for myself. And grand ladies, if you're watching this, because I know now they're watching my videos, these are mine. You don't get them. They're mine. So I did pick up two. They're just so cute. I'd say they're probably over a foot tall. And with their ears up, they're probably 16 inches tall. They're weighted at the bottom. They have the, the little bead things at the bottom to make them shelf sitters. I just think they're so adorably cute. So I picked up two. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. And let me find something here real quick to go with, with these. They're very plain. They're not decorated up in any way. But beside them, they had all kinds of really pretty spring Easter type ribbons. So I picked up one of the, it's white with the multicolor dots. Let me put my glasses on. Those aren't Easter eggs, are they? I think they're just dots. Yes, they're just dots. <clears throat> and then I got the pink with the white dots. So I'm going to make little bows and things for on them just to make them more more festive for Easter. And these little ribbons, it says woven in the USA. The company is Offray. This is different than what is normally there. And the size is three eighths of an inch by nine feet. And it says, what does it say here? They're made in the USA, finished in Mexico. And they're hundred percent polyester. So I thought those were really pretty. I just picked up these. They had several different styles and widths and everything else to choose from. But these were the two that really popped out for me to go with the bunnies. And I, they all had pink ears. So I don't know if they have other colors or anything out there. But I thought they would go well together. So that's what I got. And while I was up in that general area, <clears throat> I saw these. I have seen other people haul these. I just think these are so pretty. Even if you're not going to use them as a functioning mister, how pretty is that? And they also had different color tops. I think one was solid white and one was maybe a, a light, like a mint green color. But I got this one. It's more of like a gold bronze type color. And they're flower misters. I don't know if you can hear that, but they do sound like they function and who makes this? Let me see. What does it say? It says plant mister. And they're made by Greenbrier. The tops are not metal. They're made to look like metal, but they are not. They are plastic. And let me see. It does have like a little straw end. So I'm going to give these a try. I have a couple plants that would probably love to be misted. So I, I just picked up one. But look how stylish that is. Even if you just want to set that somewhere. So pretty. So I just grabbed one. And then they had these. Oh, I should have showed the plant thing. I think I grabbed one of these a while back. But I picked up another one when I saw it. And it is two pieces. You get both pieces. It's like a little candy bowl. What do they call it? Probably a candy bowl. They call it container with lid. And it has kind of the etching. It is plastic. It is not glass. But I may do a craft with these for Christmas for next year and make a lantern out of it. So that's why I picked up another. I believe I already have one. I need to check on that. But I think they're just so pretty. And even if you don't do that, just to put Q-tips, cotton balls, candy, whatever you would want to put in these. And they are a really nice size. So I just grabbed one of those. And in the plant area, I should have showed these first, I finally found these. I've seen other people hauling them, and I didn't see them until this shopping trip. These are the garden collection, and they're called a plastic watering stake. 
and they're kind of the globe. It has the long, long tube with a, a hole at the end and it is angled. You fill it up and then you just stick it down in your plant and you don't have to water your plant directly as much. So I grabbed two of them. I grabbed one in the green and one in the blue and I believe they also come in pink. I didn't see any clear. I would have preferred a clear one, but I didn't see any of those. So, so I just grabbed two to give these a try and see how they work. Pretty cool. And they are very long. They're well over a foot long and they are plastic. If you guys have tried these, let me know your thoughts on those. Let me see, which way should I go here? I picked up, I use one of these Swiffer things down here in the, the main floor of the house, in the bathroom, in the kitchen. Absolutely love them. And I have another spare handle. So I grab these to go upstairs on the handle that I already have. And you need the handle and then you need this little base. And this is called, what is this? What is this one called? A flat mop head, wet, dry, flat mop head. It kind of has Velcro on the sides like a Swiffer. And then you have to pick up the pad. I really, this is the pad I pick up all the time. And they just go together. And the Velcro sticks from one to the other. When this gets cruddy, throw it in the washing machine, wash it up. I use it many, many, many times. And it's it hangs in there very well. So yeah, I grabbed that. This is going to go for the upstairs bathroom. And this is called the Microfiber Mop Pad Heavy Duty. And they are both by the Essentials Company. It has the little end that you screw the, the handle in. These work so well. This is probably, if I would have to do another top 20 items at the Dollar Tree, which I may do here sometime this coming year, this is probably going to be one of the things on it because they work great. And they have so many different different um, like mop ends that you can put on. A regular mop. They have the different styles of these. They have the real fluffy ones just for like dusting your floor. So many different, different ones. A broom end. So yeah, I, I like those a lot. I saw this and this looked very different to me. It is called B4 Toilet Drops in the scent Eucalyptus Breeze. They also had lavender, but I'm not a super big lavender scent fan. And it says, think before you stink. Fill the bathroom with clean and refreshing scents of B4 Toilet Drops. It says flip top, drip drops, and go. So I thought that was pretty interesting. On the bottom, I did cut the tape that was on the top. It was sealed, but I cut it so I wouldn't take as much time. But on the bottom, it says push. So when you push, it's, it's like a drawer and it slides up and it has the little, little drops. They're kind of like the poo be gone spray, but these are droplets. So it's not opened. I didn't try the scent yet, but I thought that was pretty different. I've never seen something like that in there before. So I just grabbed one to give it a try. If you guys have tried these, let me know what you think. Interesting. And then in the healthcare type section, they had all kind of first aid kits in there. These are great to have. Throw in your car, throw in your RV, throw in a, a backpack, book bag. I think these are awesome. And this is the Care Us brand value kit. It's a wound care kit, all in one solution. And this is good for large wounds. And you get 20 pads and tape of assorted sizes in there. So I thought that was a great deal to have on hand. And everything is packaged nicely in there for you. I need to make a kit to put in Hubby's truck. I don't know if he has a, a first aid kit in the truck or not. Then they had this pack. And it is the Care Pack first aid kit. You get 21 items. And it says travel size, go with you anywhere. And on the back, it shows you exactly what all is in the kit. And that's just the thing, the information. But 21 items in there for a dollar. And it is a hard case. So that would be nice to throw in, you know, throw in a vehicle. Very nice. And then they had this, and this is a name brand. This is John Johnson and Johnson. Sorry, my hands are kind of shaky today. And this is the first aid kit and you get 12 items. 
and it says on the back what all you get. You get two hand cleaning wipes, four gauze pads, two Band-Aid brand flexible fabric bandages, and four brand flexible fabric adhesive bandages. Oh, they're different sizes. Two of one size, two of another size, and one durable plastic case, which you can refill. If you use the things out of it, you can refill these and use them again. I, I think that's a great deal. But name brand, Johnson & Johnson. So we picked up one, one of each. Let me see, which way? How about like the electronic section now? I saw this and thought this was really interesting. It's Axis Grip and it says a phone ring and desk stand. Magnetic mount, magnet mount compatible. The grip that does it all. And it kind of shows you in the pictures what it does there. Interesting. So I picked up one of these to see what this is about. I'm not a big fan of having one of the like pop socket type things on the back of my phone. It drives me crazy. But I'm going to try this and see. It looks like maybe you can attach it and detach it with the magnet. Peel and stick strong adhesive compatible with all smartphones. Interesting. Very sleek. It's metal. Very sleek looking. Pretty cool. Great Easter basket stuffer. And I picked up two more of these. You guys saw these in one of my last hauls. I believe I showed it in purple. I found it in solid black this time. These are the by Alpha Line, the hard protective camera cases. These have a super long a super long cord that comes with it, the handle. It's going to be very hard to show that. You could wear this as a, a crossbody. I'm not really buying these as a camera case. I'm going to throw these, I believe, in Easter baskets or something. I think these would be great for your little earphones, whatever it may be. You can throw miscellaneous stuff in there. <clears throat> I think they're great. They're hard. If, you know, If you go camping or backpacking or biking or whatever it may be, these would be great to have just to carry all your miscellaneous small things in, put it in your purse and put, you know, cough drops and tissues and lip balm and whatever. I just think it's a great deal. So I did pick up two more, both in black. I didn't see any other colors this time. So I just stuck with black. I'm just going to throw these things on the floor. Hubby saw these and picked up a couple. They're the, the little drive yourself crazy puzzle little things. And he grabbed two. This one is really heavy. So I'm not sure what he's going to do with these, but they're called brain teasers. They had all different styles. And I don't know if these are just going to be put away as stocking stuffers for next year or if these are going to go in Easter baskets. Not quite sure, but or maybe Hobby just wants to sit and play with some brain teasers. Interesting. They had all different kinds as well. So. And the, the store that we go into all the time, they're having some kind of contest. I guess all doll, Dollar Trees do it. They're having a contest, and whatever store sells the most, the Harry Bow gummies, they, they win a prize or something. So, of course, they talked me into buying some Harry Bow gummies. And these are called Gold Bears. And it took us a while to figure out what the flavors were in here, but it does say it on the back. And they are raspberry and pineapple flavor. And it is a four ounce bag of the Harry Bow gummies. I'm not a super big fan of the Harry Bow gummies, but these will get eaten. The kids will eat them. Now, you guys know me the watermelon Harry Bow and the berries, the little raspberry and blackberry looking ones. Oh my, major addiction. But figured I'd, I'd help out the store and buy a pack. So I did. I believe that's the only candy in this haul. That's amazing, isn't it? Then I finally found these big honkin' jugs of the Simply, the hand soap, liquid hand soap in the clear, washes away germs compared to Soft Soap Aquarium Series hand soap. This is the refill bottle. It is a 56 fluid ounce jug of this. I think that is absolutely amazing. And this is distributed by Colgate Palmolive Company big thing. They also had the pumps, the hand pumps in the smaller bottles, but I need to sneeze. <coughs> One more. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry, guys. But they also had the, the regular little bottles that you would sit 
on your sink with the hand pump. But I have so many soap hand pump things that I didn't need that when I could pick up this big jug. But 56 fluid ounces for that, that is awesome. So I just grabbed one. I have a ton of hand soap to go through. I'm gonna set this off to the side, guys. I ran out of my LA is totally awesome. This is the bathroom cleaner in the fresh scent. This is the yellow spray bottle. Love this stuff. Absolutely love it. This is a 32 fluid ounce spray bottle of this. I love all three of them. Those are the only ones I've seen so far. One is clear and it's for like in your shower, you like a daily shower spray. I use it all the time, even as a straight cleaner. This is the bathroom cleaner itself. And then there is a red one, and I believe it's like a multi-purpose cleaner. I use it all the time too. They work great. And I ran out of one, so I grabbed grabbed another. I love this stuff. It works super well for me. I just wet down whatever I'm going to clean, wet down my sink, spray it down, let it sit for two or three minutes, come back, and just it. you could just easily feel the soap scum coming right off. Picked up some books for the Itty Bitty Girl, the Itty Bitty Lady. These are by Creative Teaching Materials. This one is called My Day, and it says you get, includes 10 free song downloads. Okay. But this book is all about their day. It says getting ready, eating, learning fun, outside, and bedtime. And it just has a lot of really cool pictures, bright colors, information, words. Just awesome. And then this one is Alphabet, also by Creative Teaching Materials. It includes 10 free song downloads. And this is the Alphabet. And it goes through all the letters, A through F, G through L. And it just has all kind of pictures with the letters and a corresponding, you know, like H is for horse. Read to your kids, guys. It's important. Some of these books are going to go in her Easter basket. Some are going to stay here. And then they had the Sesame Street books. And I've already picked up a couple of the Sesame Street. And she seems to really enjoy them. And we had a sleepover with them not too long ago. And it was so cute. Her older sister was reading, reading her a book, the baby, a book. And the baby went and grabbed another book and stood up right beside her big sister. And she opened the book and she was chattering. She was reading her book right along with her big sister. It was so cute. So we grabbed some more books to have here. And this is Murray's first book of words. So cute. This one is Bert and Ernie's first book of opposites. This one is Grover's first day at school. And this one is Zoe's first book of seasons. And these are the hard, all of these. This one is a little bit thinner, but it's still very, very sturdy. And this one, these are like the harder, thicker, like cardboard style books. So we picked up those for her to put in probably her Easter basket and keep some of them here. Something different and new for her to look at and, and read to us. <clears throat> but anyway, guys, I think that is about it for this haul. I need to go and get this putty putty. <laughs> I need to go and get this put away. So anyway, guys, I'm going to get off of here. You guys have a great day. If you like this type of thing, please subscribe. I'd love to have you as part of my YouTube family. You guys are the best. I'll talk to you soon, everybody. Peace.